Hi, I just want to give a quick demonstration of Swipe and some quick tips and tricks to try out. Um, I'm using Swipe on the Motorola Droid. So first I just want to write a sentence saying, Hi, this is the Droid Geek. Okay, and you can see that all I... Oop, this is not right. This should be is, not us. Um... All I did was slide my fingers over the keys on the keyboard and it automatically knew which word I was trying to write. Um, there's a few tricks that, uh, that can help make this experience a little smoother for you. Um, for one, when starting off a sentence, you want to start with a capital letter. What you have to do is slide your finger above the virtual keyboard and it will automatically capitalize. So I'm going to go up here to H and then down to I. You'll get that capital high. Um, if you want something in all caps, like hello or hi in all caps, you can just go up, swirl your finger around a few times, wait for that caps lock icon to be um, depressed, come back to I, and it'll be capitalized for you. As you can see, I'm not very accurate, but it still knows the words that are most commonly used. So it's, it's pretty good at picking up and knowing what, what words you're trying to spell. Um, some of the things that you might, might want to know is that when you're writing like a, a double word, like if you're writing hello, with a double letter in it. You want to swirl your finger over the key a few times. Um, watch when I get to the L that I just kind of swirl it around. Go back to the O and it puts the uh, double L in there for you. Um, with punctuation, you have to uh, slide, go to the punctuation mark you want, like the period or the question mark, and slide it your finger to the space bar so it'll automatically put that space in there for you. So if I do hello, um, droid geek, period to the space bar it puts that space in there for you. Same thing with the question mark. Um, do you like swipe? Swipe right there. Um, question mark to the space. And you can see I misspelled. But see, when you misspell something, all you gotta do is double tap the word. Sorry, I took a little bit there, and you can just redo it. And as again, you can see when you do that question mark to the space, it puts that question mark in the space, so you continue typing on your way. Um, one other thing I really like about swipe is that if it doesn't know a word, you can manually enter it in, right? So H F V U G, um, hit space and enter, and then if I go down. It automatically learn that word, so when I type it again, it, it has picked it up as a uh, known word. So that's about it. Um, if you have any questions, um, post them on my blog, and I'll be sure to answer them as quickly as possible. And I hope you enjoyed.